Hello and welcome to the uh, video for fifth grade for the homework uh, for Friday, April the 17th. And so this is going to cover lesson 10.1. I am going to kind of not entirely speed run this, but I am going to go as quickly as I can um, writing the answers in while explaining the way that I would think through this. So um, if you are comfortable enough with the measurements, um, this should be just a matter of doing um, some multiplication and or maybe division um, on a couple of the problems, especially um, later towards the end. Um, so first one, five feet, there's 12 inches and a foot. Five times 12 gives us 60. Number four, um, if I do uh, 120 inches, that would give me 10 feet. So this would be worth 20 feet. Number six, Again, 120 inches would be uh, 10 feet. Uh, number eight, I can do seven times three uh, to get my number of yards and add two feet to that. So 21 plus two gives me 23. Uh, number 10, two feet is worth 24 inches. So two feet um, would be the larger side. So 23 inches is less than two feet. Uh, for a mile, it would be 5,280 feet. If I do that plus 900, that would give me 6180. Uh, so my left-hand side is going to be larger. Uh, number 14, if I do 300 yards times three feet, that gives me 900 feet. Uh, so this side would be larger. Number 16, if I need 12 yards of material to make banner, or if I get 12 yards of material and I make use one foot uh, for each banner, I'm going to have 36 feet, so that means I can make 36 banners. Number one on the back, um, five yards long. How long is their garden in feet? Five times three would give me the answer. That would be 15 feet. And then our last one, we can kind of use division for this, but I'm going to show you a trick. So we would essentially be doing uh, one yard, which would be uh, 36 inches on the outside, and we would start with 180 inches, divide that by 36. This number is twice the size of this one, so the number that I should start guessing with, because 10 times 36 would give me 360, would be five, and then when I do that, I am going to end up getting exactly 180. So my answer would be uh, five yards to have that, so. That would be uh, the easiest way to do that. So those are the answers for the homework problems. I hope that makes sense for you. If you have any questions, please feel free to post in Google Classroom, and I will be happy to answer any additional questions that you have. Hope you have a wonderful weekend, and I will see you on Monday.